YouTube, what's going on? Tech King Mike back with another video for you guys. And today we have the Ghost Tech Atomic Slim cases for the Galaxy S23 Ultra on deck. Now shout out to Ghost Tech for sending, for sending these cases out to me. These cases are actually becoming one of my favorite cases to use for the Galaxy S23 Ultra. So we have the black color here and then we have an exclusive color here, limited edition color as well. So let's take a look at the packaging and see what we get. Now we get some Ghost Tech. R7X shock absorbing technology. On the back, we have wireless charging compatible. We have multi-layered, non-slip grip, raised camera lip, aluminum alloy frame. That is one of the things that I like about this case, the aluminum frame. As you can see, it's a two-part case, two-piece case, slim precise fit, and a limited lifetime warranty. This is the Atomic Slim from Ghost Tech. So pretty simple on the branding, nothing too fancy or too crazy. Let's pull this case out. We'll put that over there. And of course, as you can see inside, put the case down right here, you get your insert that goes on the back of the phone. You get a little bit of Ghost Tech material here. We'll put that off to the side as well. You get a little Ghost Tech, Ghost Tech sticker, troll sticker. And then of course you have all your social media cards and this is your warranty card. So this is where you go if you need to have any questions. Thank you for your purchase agent. So, shout out to Ghost Tech for the dope cases, man. Thank you for y'all sending these out to me. Now, off the top, a few critiques. First things first, I wish that this back had the micro dot texture so that it wasn't just so, it didn't pick up fingerprints as fast as it does. With this being such a clear and the glass type of material that it is, tempered glass, plastic, whatever you want to call it, it is going to show a lot of dust. It is going to show a lot of fingerprints. I wish it was a matte texture possibly, but... Lucky for you guys, they do have different versions of it on their website. Now, of course, taking a look around, got that aluminum frame on the side. The buttons are open. I wish the buttons were closed. Like I'm not, a, I'm not really a fan of this style because I feel like it allows dirt or you know debris or anything to get inside of there. And I wish that they would be closed off. But looking inside of the case, man, you guys can see all of that impact resistance material in there. This is meant to help. The, the case, when you drop your phone, it's meant to truly help make sure that your phone does not take the brunt of the fall. It's a lot of it. You see, you got some on the back there. You got some up top here, all along the sides and the edges, man. So this is a really nice case when it comes to protecting your phone. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go on ahead and pop out. I'm going to pop this out and we're going to put the phone inside of the case. Now, like I said, it's a two part style case. And there's no instructions on how to put it in the case. So I'm just going to try to put it in here and we're just going to see what happens. So we just pop it right on in and that's it. So this is the Atomic Slim case. Now this is the black variant. I like it. I like the P shape. A lot of people do not like this uniform when it comes to the cutout for the cameras. I personally enjoy it. I'd rather it be a more uniform cutout than it just be a big opening back here. I feel like that's just lazy to me that people could have took the time to do that. I mean, if Rinky can take the time to make the cutouts, I don't understand why more people can't. So, Ghost Tech, I like what you're doing here. Now, of course, as you can see at the bottom, you got plenty of access to your S Pen. Pull the S Pen out with no problem. Wide enough port for the USB-C port. And, of course, the buttons work just fine. They're not necessarily as clicky but the buttons do work just fine and does have a good little bit of grip on it so you don't feel like you're going to drop the phone so this is actually pretty nice like i said my only thing is just i wish that this was just more of a matte texture and not such a fingerprint magnet but it is what it is now let's pop this off i'm gonna pop this off and we're gonna try this limited edition colorway that they sent as well so let's pop this off. If we can pop it off, there we go. Pop it off down by the S pen seems to be the way. All right, so we'll take the black one off. And now let's try this limited edition color. Limited edition, okay, you guys see it, you see it, limited edition. Got the blue joint. Oh, that blue is cold, man. Got the blue joint on deck. Check this out, y'all, check this out. 96 of 100. I don't know if y'all can see that. I don't know if y'all can see that. 96 of 100. So, limited edition, man. This is definitely going to be one of those cases that goes into the archive for this device, man. Limited edition case. Now, 
Sorry if y'all hear my computer. For whatever reason, the fans decided to just ramp up like crazy. And once again, there it is. The Atomic Slim in blue. And this is same as before with the black. You have your opening over here for your buttons. The buttons work just fine. USB-C cut out at the bottom along with the S-Pen. Got your raised grips on the side here. This is a nice, solid case, man. I truly do like this case. Makes the phone considerably thicker. Now, that is one thing to consider. It makes the phone considerably thicker. For context, here is the here is the Samsung leather case next to it. And, I mean, as you can see, it's very it's considerably thicker, but makes the phone feel more solid, makes the phone feel more protected. And I am a fan. I'm liking this case, man. I don't know if I'm going to use the blue one because I'm kind of one of those people. Like, I like exclusivity, you know what I'm saying? Especially, you know, like I got the Marquez wallet and everything. So I like to hold on to the, you know, limited edition items and not, like, abuse them. But I do like this case. I will probably be rocking the black one, especially when you get, like, a D-brand skin on the back here. That's going to look pretty fire with this clear opening. So, anyway, this is going to be the Atomic Slim case for the Galaxy S23 Ultra. Let me know what you guys think about this case down at the bottom in the comments below. Also, if you're interested in picking one up, I will have links in the description for you to check it out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.